<laughs> oh my gosh, my cat is being so noisy. Hello everybody and welcome back to LPS Sugar Cubes. Today I'm going to be doing another 10 types video. Today I'm going to be doing 10 types of Harry Potter fans because as you guys probably know by my Harry Potter related videos lately, I am a huge Harry Potter nerd. I love Harry Potter, it's my favorite thing in the world. You guys can probably tell by my Harry Potter background. I have the fifth and the third book as my background. Now it's time for me to stop rambling, so let's get on with the video. Type number one, the Harry Potter fan who dresses up as one of the characters every single Halloween. Yeah, I'm Cinderella for Halloween. Oh yeah, that's cool, I guess. I'm Hermione Granger from the fourth book, The Goblet of Fire, when she's at the Yule Ball. <laughs> oh yeah, that girl from Harry Potter, but weren't you her last year? What was it, from the third one, The Prisoner of Azkabaz? <laughs> The Prisoner of Azkaban. Azkaban with an N. <laughs> it's okay, no big deal. It's, it's fine, it's fine. Type number two, the Harry Potter fan who literally just sits in a corner and reads the Harry Potter books non-stop. And I have to admit, this is me most of the time. Hmm. <gasps> no way. <gasps> hey, Annabeth, I'm heading to the mall and I was wondering if you wanted to join. Hmm? Uh, oh, um, thanks for inviting me, but I, I think I'll just stay behind and read. But the Forever 21 colors are on sale. Darby, really, I'm fine. I really just want to read. <sighs> Whatever, suit yourself. Type number three, the Harry Potter fan with the parents who are slightly worried with how big their obsession with Harry Potter is. Okay, honey, have you picked out what you want for your birthday yet? <laughs> yes. I want Hermione's time turner. You know. The one from the third book, The Prisoner of Azkaban. <laughs> please, 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 It's on sale, and I found the perfect one in the Bates. Already in the cart. Oh, is that that Harry Potter thing again you're always babbling on about? Yeah, okay, I have to admit, I have a little bit of an obsession. Honey, it is not just a little obsession. You're addicted to this Harry Potter thing. I never liked it anyways. Honey, I think it's starting to become a problem. I'm sincerely worried about you. Type number four, the Harry Potter fan who actually thinks Hogwarts is real and they think they're actually a wizard. Dude, I'm telling you, I'm a wizard. I got the letter from Hogwarts on my 11th birthday. I've been going to Hogwarts ever since. I've won the Triwizard Tournament. Trust me, bro, I'm the greatest wizard of all time. All right, then let's see some spells. <laughs> uh, dude, you're not supposed to do magic outside of Hogwarts. <laughs> Amateur. Type number five, the Harry Potter fan who always talks about Harry Potter so that their friends and family are annoyed with it. Oh my goodness, you know Harry Potter? Yeah, I just finished the last book, and oh my goodness, the third one was definitely my favorite overall, but the last one was such a bad one. My nerve was only like, I can hardly breathe. By the way, the time turn of the Iron Man Me Bay game is ready, and I got the three Deathly Hollow necklaces. I was thinking, you, me, and Quinn could all have one, then we got me matching Harry Potter Deathly Hollow fans. Like, oh my gosh, yeah, it doesn't it sound amazing. Type number six, the Harry Potter fan who is all the Harry Potter merch and everything and just wants to tell everyone that they are the biggest Harry Potter fan ever. Just wanted to let everybody know I got the Harry Potter backpack. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Got the Gryffindor costume and I got my own wand. I went to Universal Studios, went to Harry Potter land, so <laughs> I'm the biggest Harry Potter fan in the school, probably in the whole entire universe, so don't you damn try to overthrow me. I'm the biggest Harry Potter fan in the school because we all know it's me, it's all me, it's guys. Guys, it's, it's me. Type number seven, the Harry Potter fan who isn't really a Harry Potter fan. They just kind of want to jump on the bandwagon and be a Harry Potter fan because everyone else is. So, you're a Harry Potter fan. Uh, yeah, yeah, um, totally, yeah. I'm a huge Harry Potter fan. Have been for years, definitely. So, which book was your favorite? Ah, oh, they're all amazing. I can't decide. But I I mean, decide. I, uh, I've totally read them all, by the way. Totally. Mm-hmm. Bye! Type number eight, the Harry Potter fan who's basically way too indulgent in that they have no social life, all they care about is Harry Potter. It's okay, um, I'm the weirdest kid in school. Everybody thinks I'm weird, but it's okay, it's okay. I really actually don't care because I can't just go all read my Harry Potter books and forget I ever exist. Okay, gotta get a Harry Potter. Gotta get a Harry Potter. Type number nine, the Harry Potter fan who has a crush on all the Harry Potter boys. 
Yeah, so uh, <laughs> I had a huge crush on Cedric Diggory last year. You know, the Hufflepuff <laughs> Quidditch player. Yeah, I had a huge crush on him last year. But, like, right now I'm actually having a huge crush on Ron Weasley. <laughs> oh, my goodness. And lastly, type number 10, the normal Harry Potter fan, the one who's read all the books, all the movies, and they just really enjoy it. They're not weird about it. They're just, you know, a normal Harry Potter fan. Yeah, I'm a huge Harry Potter fan. Yeah, I've loved the whole series ever since I was nine. Yeah, I, it's like my favorite thing in the world, but I'm not like too obsessed with it, you know, but yeah, I love Harry Potter.